Hi, I'm Michelle V. Hill with Michelle's Money Minutes. And today I'm gonna to be talking about becoming a wise consumer. Google described several characteristics of a wise consumer. Alert, watchful over transactions to avoid being cheated. Budget conscious, you evaluate before you buy. Reasonable, you consider the price, quantity, and the quality not affected by advertising, which is very difficult to do, to not be um, influenced. People who are wise consumers value quality and prices, and those are the selling points for them. A lot of times they're analytical, not always. Um, they look for substitutions and alternatives to the particular item, unless it's something you can't normally get and avoid panic buying. So being a wise consumer uh, consists of multiple decisions over time. Choosing to spend on consumer goods and services. Like I said, awareness, research, and action can aid you in your quest towards becoming a wiser consumer. Most people who are called consumers enjoy getting a good or service that enhances the quality of their life in some way. I do. I love beauty products, so those are those are things that, as I age, I always go to. Going from a raisin to a grape, it, it hasn't worked yet. Anyway, think of all the consumer goods that are available to us in the United States. Just an unbelievable amount. The choices can be overwhelming and thrilling at the same time. Beauty products, exercise equipment, vacations, home decor, vehicles, new food items, garden gadgets, pet products, and more. It's exciting to me to discover a solution to a problem with an available good or service. Um, the goal is to get the best deal on the items that you normally buy and then have peace with your decisions. A person gets better with practice and will learn the best um, sometimes where the best deals are at certain points in time. Not always, sometimes you run across a great bargain. It will depend on where you live. It will depend on your access to goods and services. Um, with the internet though and home delivery, a lot of things are available to us here in Wyoming that weren't as easily um, several years ago. So um, time is also a factor that needs to be considered when researching goods and services because th some things are put on sale seasonally. Um, think about clothing after the after the season, things like that. I, I, for myself, I tend to put more time and research into expensive items such as homes, vehicles, and other things, although I do watch the prices on the small items as well because everything adds up. Businesses get feedback also through their goods and services, through customer communication, profits, customer satisfaction, reputation, and more. Um, customers have the power to build or break a business and by casting their economic vote on goods and services. So if a business is pr a producing a good good or service, make sure that you let them know that and, and give them positive feedback. Um, and I always reach out to the company, whether it be really positive or if I have a real negative experience and then let them know um, my experience so that it can help them and potentially help me uh, get some resolution, especially if it was negative. Keep in mind too that um, with, with your wise consumer habits, it's your life journey and how you use your resources your, is your business. Every person wants a variation of things in their life depending on where they're at in their life stage. And so consider your needs carefully uh, before buying anything because we all have a lot of stuff here in the US. Um, there have been several people I would give con that I would consider wise consumers. Uh, they got their best deal at the time on the good or service that they wanted. Think about something that you would buy, like to buy and then strategize your plan. Um, a lot of times people get fantastic deals um, by doing their research. Uh, going to Consumer Reports is a great place to do some research so that you can look to see unbiased reviews on things so that they're not taking money from the manufacturer because that tends to uh, flavor what they're doing. Anyway, the goal is to get the best deal on the items that you purchase and then have peace. So why, wise consumer gets better with practice and learns what works for them while purchasing goods and services. If you like this, please like and share.
Thank you so much. Happy, happy shopping. Thank you.